Hello everyone. We're currently in Christchurch. Well, Christchurch. I love airport. Uganda. That's my brother. We are currently walking to McDonald's, and this is our final meal because this is actually our last day in Christchurch, and then we're going back to Melbourne. We are currently going to Mommy. McDonald's. Um, we're currently like returning from a two-week holiday, holiday, a two-week holiday in New Zealand. Which has been fantastic. New Zealand has been extremely beautiful. I've taken so many photos. I love New Zealand. Um, but we're going back because it's about time we get back to work in Melbourne. And yes, I do kind of look like an egg right now because it's kind of raining. McDonald's! <laughs> Can I do my favor? Good morning, everyone. Today is Tuesday. I mean, Wednesday. Yesterday was Tuesday, and I got back from New Zealand. And surprisingly, I don't really feel any jet lag. Today, I have to go get a maths textbook from someone on Facebook Marketplace. So that's gonna take up my morning. I also like wrote a little notion schedule that I did yesterday. So I'm gonna follow that. And I've like time blocked it out so I don't waste any time. I feel like when I don't time block my day out, I end up wasting so much time and I end up not getting everything done. Oh my God, you guys, we just got a new car today. So I'm going to do like a little car unboxing reveal. Oh, it's leather. My old car did not have leather. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god, it's so spacious. Like, I don't know why it's like so fuzzy, the camera. But it's like leather seats. Here's the front. Oh, I don't know why the flash turned on, but here's the front. Um, We've never had a car that has like an iPad. So there's like a little mini iPad JBL. It's like a moonroof. Oh, that's soft. Which, like, it's like a huge window on the roof. Okay, yeah, the flash not working. It's USB-C, and that's, like, so good because... Wait, shit, that's not USB-C. Wait, yes, it is. It's so good because, like, the new iPhone cables only have USB-C, and they don't have the normal USB, like, port. So I can finally charge my phone. Oh, my God, that's so good. So... It's like a little cute detail, so instead of opening up like a normal one like that, it opens up like this. And inside there's some stuff. Oh, that's really big. I don't know what you'd be putting in there. Can you open this? No, you can't open that. Maple. She had a bath yesterday and now she's so clean. Hi Maple. Having hot pot for dinner. These are the condiments. We're also having sushi. So it's like Chinese, Japanese fusion.
Today is Friday. It is currently 8.40. I have a Japanese tutoring lesson today in the morning at 9.30. And then I'm going out with my friends later this afternoon. So in between that time, I'm planning to do a little bit of work. And maybe when I come home, I'll also do a little bit more work because school is starting soon, next week. Next week, I'm already back to school. So, I'm ready to start this new year, but of course I need to prepare for the new year, like I am now. I have my tea, so I'm going to start making my time block schedule for today, because as we all know, if I don't time block my day, I do nothing, and I waste time, and I end up not practicing my instruments, because I'm a lazy piece of shit. I'm going to get to this. So this is my to-do for today, as you can see I've marked the time of which I have to do everything. We literally just got our school schedules for this year, and this is going to sound so stupid, but the day I get my planner, I mean not my planner, my schedule, is like the happiest day of my week because I just like it so much. Um, the only problem with my school timetabling system is that our periods only last like 40 minutes, like 43 minutes. And like, what am I supposed to do? Like, that's enough time for me to get my tea, sit down and prepare everything to study. Like by the time I've gotten ready in class, it's like, not that I drink tea in class, but by the time that I've gotten ready, it's like the period is over. I have tried and failed to draw a nucleus so many times. Like I tried to do it 3D, like I was trying to copy this picture, but this is actually so much harder to draw on paper than it actually looks. Like that looks so easy to draw, right? These are my failed attempts. Like, what is this? What is this? What is this? This looks like an egg. And this is my final, um, Diagram. Three wasted so much of my time. So I just finished doing chapter one of biology and I've been doing chapter one for a while now because I started it before I went on holiday and then I finished it um, today or at least making some like active recall questions today and 
I am so tired and sick and tired of chapter one of biology. It's organelles. And I feel like I just have to move past it. Because if I don't move past it now, I will never get past chapter one of biology. I'm not extremely familiar with like the organelle functions and structures and like drawing everything but literally if I don't move past it now I will never get past this chapter so starting from tomorrow I'm gonna to do chapter two because I'm sick and tired of this chapter of biology my hair I have grapes I only eat crunchy grapes. I refuse to eat squishy grapes because I don't like the consistency and the texture. And this sounds really spoiled, but I literally feel like grossed out by squishy grapes. Also, I just got a haircut, so that's why there's hair in my grapes. All right, I just got this game called Subnautica because I thought it looked very cool and kind of reminded me of Avatar The Way in the Water and I'm kind of obsessed with Avatar The Way in the Water right now. So I'm looking forward to starting this game. Oh my god, what is happening? Guys, this game is so pretty and the music is actually pretty nice and it actually does remind me of Avatar. I love this game. It is currently 10.30 a.m. and I'm feeling kind of like I'm running out of steam. And luckily, I scheduled a break yesterday when I was making my plan. I scheduled a break from 10.30 to 12. And I'm gonna walk my dog and play some Stardew Valley, which I haven't played before. Because yesterday I bought Subnautica and Stardew Valley on Steam. I feel like every day is the same in the summer. Like, I've only really technically had like a summer holiday for about one or two weeks because I was overseas for most of the holidays. But literally, I wake up, I do some work, <clears throat> I maybe exercise and I chill, and I practice my instruments. And then the day ends and I begin it again. And like, school, I guess, is also kind of monotonous and kind of like, the same thing every day but it's also not because you're always learning different things I mean like you're moving on with your life you feel some progression but in the summer holidays it's just like stagnant especially because the summer holidays here is like six weeks 